niya sa isang beauty clinic na ginastos niya ang pera ng kanilang kumpanya. Si Bonivach ay nahaharap sa mareklamong estafa dahil sa isyong ito. Ang report mula kay Nelson Canlas. Ang grande ng magbukas ang beauty clinic na Beverly Hill 6715 noong September 2006. Mismo ang dating Miss Universe na si Diana Torres pa ang nagpasinaya at naging image model nito. Pero noong November 2007, nagkaroon ng sigalot sa kumpanya. Inakusahan ng President and CEO nitong si David Bonibax na ginamit umano ang halos 18 million pesos na pera ng kumpanya para sa kanyang personal na mga gastusin. I am very, very disappointed because I invested my uh, my retirement money in this company, mm -hmm. and I came home specifically because I am uh, anticipating the, the 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 growth of the company. Nagsimula raw magduda ang mga investor ng kumpanya nang rigoluhan ni David Bonibax ang kanyang asawang si Jessica Rodriguez ng isang mamahaling SUV. Agad raw silang nagpa-audit at pina-explica ito kay David Bonibax. There is a paper trail actually. There's a paper trail. This was discovered by the auditors. It's completely ludicrous and uh, we're still waiting for the final audit to come out in the, in the office and we're just waiting for that and what we already know It ending, it's ending up right now the company is owing me money. Bilang presidente ng kumpanya, naging kontrolado raw ni Bonibax ang pagpapaikot sa pera ng kumpanya, kasama raw dito ang ilang expansion transactions. Naging usapin din ng isang opisina ng klinika sa Los Angeles, California, nang hanapin daw ang tanggapan. When this question erupted a couple of weeks ago, we actually sent somebody, or, no, we asked somebody in the United States to investigate, and it's true that that office is non-existent anymore. But what I have to emphasize is that relationship with that U.S. office was all arranged by David. Nasa Estados Unidos daw ngayon si David Bonevax, pero depensa niya. I don't understand what the the whole uh, issue is with uh, Beverly Hills owning only two clinics versus four or five clinics like they used to. Um, it's none of my business that their businesses um, faltered over the past three years. Pero hindi raw siya nagtatago at umiiwas lang daw sa mga nagtatangka sa kanyang buhay. They came through checks. Um, they, they came through telling other people, my best friends, to relay it to me. They even told my uh, pastor. They called up my pastor. Um, you know, they told everyone to tell us, you know, that, you know, we're dead and all this kind of stuff. I mean, we have it all documented. Not, they weren't too smart. They used their own cell phones and their own their own lines uh, to send to send all the text so it's it's really hard evidence sagot naman ng mga abogado ng Beverly Hills 6750 and none of our clients are involved in this in this so called threats if these are true uh, i don't know if uh, where these threats are coming from if if there are really threats but uh, we have nothing to do with it um, as you can see we filed cases so we pursue our our complaints, our issues with him in the proper forum. Now, why will we resort to extra-legal means? Nag-file na ng reklamo sa NBI noong nakarang buwan si David Bonibax laban sa mga nanakit umano at nanakot sa kanya. Sa ngayon, may tatlong kasong estapa na rin nakasampa sa Quezon City at Maynila laban kay David Bonibax. Nelson Canla sa Katutok, 24 Horas.